Oh, and welcome everybody. We are back with another video for food lovers. That's right, food lovers. I want to just thank everybody again who has subscribed so far to the YouTube channel. Thank you. That means a lot. Thank you to everybody who not only subscribed but also hit the like button on the videos and who have been watching them as they come out. I mean, it's a new channel. It's growing. There will be more contact coming to you soon. Now, I've seen on like Facebook and TikTok, YouTube and Twitter and all these other channels um, and social medias, how everybody is making like this big deal out of this new Coca-Cola. That's right, this new Coca-Cola called Ultimate Limited Edition. Now, they just keep coming out with this kind of stuff. I don't really drink soda much anymore, but I figured for all of my food lovers and foodies and food family, why not give it a try? So, let's do that. All right, I mean, I wouldn't really say it has a taste. I mean, it's definitely a peculiar taste, if I could even use that. I mean, yeah, it doesn't really taste like anything. I mean, to me personally, it kind of tastes like Stale bubble gum, to be honest with you, but that's just my opinion. But while I was in the store, which happened to be Cumberland Farms, you know, I I haven't tried their pizza or anything yet, and I've and I've been wanting to try it. So I figured while I was in there, I was going to buy myself a slice and give it a try. I grabbed the cheese because I like myself some good cheese pizza. I also like anchovy pizza. It's one of my favorites, but unfortunately, at uh, convenience stores like this, they're not going to have that. Um, I mean, it's fresh. It's hot. The uh, bottom crust is kind of flimsy. The cheese looks like it's kind of burnt a little, which isn't bad. I mean, I, I like that. I like some burnt cheese on a, oh, excuse me, on a pizza. Um, crust looks all right. It looks kind of soft, gooey in the middle. So let's give it a try. All right. I mean, Peach is not bad. Taste is alright. I mean, has good flavor. The dough is a little kind of doughy for me. I like somewhat of a, not a stiff crust, but you know, I, I like the crust at the bottom and stuff to be a little crunchy. And the only soft crust I kind of like is when it's like that cheese stuff kind of crust, which I don't think this is. But let's give the crust a try. Mm. All right, I mean, hmm. The uh, let me man, all right. The crust is definitely chewy, you gotta chew it a bit. But I mean, the pizza itself, it's not bad, the taste is all right, the taste is pretty good, it has good flavor. I like the flavor of the sauce and the combination of the sauce and the cheese, it's just 
more the crust that doesn't do it for me. But, no. Mm. Gotta take another sip of this. I was in there so that they had like these chicken sticks chicken uh, fries type thing and also uh, uh, I think they call them tortitos now I got one of each I got a pepper jack tortito and a buffalo chicken uh, chicken stick or fry. All right, so here's the pepper jack tortito. Oh, let's see how this is. Oh, there's brushwood. definitely some cheese as you can see in there see got this cheese and let's try some of the cheese cheese definitely has good flavor you definitely taste some of the jalapeno pepper in there it's not very spicy it's not mild it's not hot but definitely gives it a uh, good flavor now, I don't know if this has been sitting for a while or not, but I mean, on the outside, definitely has a crust, but it's kind of chewy at the same time. It's like crunchy and chewy, if that makes any sense. Doesn't have bad flavor. And let's try the buffalo chicken. Has some good breading, some good crust. See how this tastes. Mm. All right. That's why uh, very meaty. A lot of chicken. Um, it's not very really chewy. Definitely tastes like buffalo. So if I have to vote here out of the three of these things, I would definitely say there's buffalo chicken here as my vote. Hmm. Definitely not bad. No. I mean, it is Cumberland Farms. It's like every other like 7-Eleven, Store 24, Little Peach, whatever you might have around in your area. You know, it's there for your convenience. They definitely have other foods like salads and sandwiches and even burritos. Um, so maybe some other time I'll try one, something else from inside the store of Cumberland Farms or maybe a 7-Eleven. 
Now, again, like I say in all my videos, you know, you know, please leave a comment in the comment section down below. Let me know in the comments what you like about the videos and the channel so far. And also, please let me know what you would like for me to try next. And I will go there and I'll try it on the menu. Uh, what if it's a place like McDonald's, Burger King, Wendy's, uh, Olive Garden, or a place like Cumberland Farms, or even if it's, you know, some kind of food, like takeout food or something, that a place like Stop and Shop or something uh, sells. Again, I'll go there, I'll try it, I'll give you my my opinion. Uh, that's all these videos are, is my opinion on places and how the food is. Um, maybe even if it's a restaurant you'd like to see me try, uh, let me know in the comments below again uh, where the restaurant is, where is it located. Uh, again, I'm from like the southeastern part of Massachusetts and like Rhode Island area. So if it's within my area and driving distance, I'll definitely do my best to go there, try the food out. And try whatever it is that you suggest to try on the menu. Also, please don't forget to hit the like, share the videos, and thank you again to everybody who has subscribed to the Food Lovers channel so far. So, thank you, and see you in the next video.